Hello and welcome back to another video on my channel. In this series, I'll cover budget decks for Yu-Gi-Oh! Master Duel. I'll show competent budget lists and their upgrade paths. Now, to make sure it's a budget deck, I will be following some simple limitations. I can only spend 2,000 gems on packs per deck. I can only craft one UR and one SR card per deck. And I can't use staples except the bundle one. Let's get into today's episode. In today's video, we will take a look at Tri-Brigade Lyrilusk. Bird Up, as it is sometimes called, is a Link and XYZ focus deck utilizing beasts, wing beasts, and beast warriors. The birds spam out many small critters on the field for extra deck summon, and the Tri-Brigade can banish monsters from the grave for Link summons, and have advantageous graveyard effects themselves. Now, this is the first video in the series which isn't based on a structure deck, which means we will get to pull cards. We have 2000 gems or 20 packs to build a deck, and if you want to see how the pulls went, I've linked a video in the description below. But the short version is we got 3 Fergit, 3 Bird XYZs, no usable URs, and a Lava Gold. I also picked up a Dogmatica Punishment, which I decided to throw in, because why not? We combo it with the Fossil Machine, which is a normal rarity card, which can sometimes give you a plus one by popping your opponent's back row. So you pop a monster with Dogmatica, sending the Fossil Machine, then banish the Fossil Machine from your grave to pop a back row. Bird Call is our SR craft for the deck along with Shrig as our UR. I noticed Bird Strikes is like a bad version of Dark Ruler no more, so I decided to throw in three of them in the deck. With those, Chalice, Imperm Droplet, and Power Coat Talker, we actually have a ton of negates in the deck. The extra deck is pretty much any link we can get our hands on and the Literalisk XYZs that I pulled. Thankfully though, unlike yesterday's Dragon Maids, Tri Brigade can be easily upgraded. This is the middle version of Tri Brigade. A lot has changed, but as you can see it's mostly SR cards, which means this variant is still pretty cheap. Rolling Lockbird is back, an excellent cheap hand trap. I decided to include Wagtail, who searches for Bird Call on Special Summon. And of course, along with it, a couple of more Bird Call. This card is just too good. Out of Desires joins the main deck too for that juicy draw too, along with its pal Pot of Prosperity, and Tanky too, for more search power. In the extra, I added the UR Bird, XYZ, Downard and Zeus, Fairbrum to search Tribrigade Revolt, and last but not least, Access Code Talker. This version of the deck feels very powerful for being relatively cheap to make. There is only three more URs in this deck compared to the first variant. Finally, the meta version of the deck. As per usual, the main changes in the main deck is the inclusion of the UR hand traps, Maxi, Ash, and the rest, and their negators, called by and cross up. In the extra, there is a lot more URs than in the last deck list we looked at. F Zeros are now in the deck, along with the another recital Starling, and All Mirage is here too, a nice link one, as is Double Dragon Lord and Smorg. This, as you might know, was the number one meta threat when Master Duel launched and is still very powerful. I played it back then and it was a lot of fun. I feel Tri Brigade is a fine choice for any free to play or budget player. Even with only a few SR card crafts and a couple of URs it can really pop off. Thank you for watching my video and I hope you enjoyed it. If you did feel free to drop a like on the video and maybe subscribe. Anyway, I'll see you later.